Hi everyone, it's Jeff here from Avada with an Avada short. In this video, we're going to look at converting to Flexbox containers and columns in Avada. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the bell icon to be notified of all new content. Okay, let's begin. Flexbox containers and columns were introduced way back in Avada 7.0. For new sites created after that, Flexbox is the default, but for existing sites, legacy support was enabled. So if you have some old websites created before Avada 7, it's possible the content is still using the old setup. An easy way to tell if your containers are using the legacy mode is simply to edit them. If they have an option at the top called container type, you have legacy container support enabled. And if the container is set to legacy, then it's not using Flexbox. Converting to Flexbox is very easy. You can just change to Flex here on the container option. The container is instantly updated, and you will see some new options in the sidebar. Depending on the content and settings, you might get some slight design shift, but usually it will be minor. If you want to convert to Flexbox globally, just head to the Global Options and the Avada Builder Elements, and Containers, and at the bottom, set the Legacy Container Support option to No. As it says in the description, if you disable Legacy Mode and then save a page, all containers on that page will be saved as Flex Mode. So I'll just set this to No, and save that option and this page. So now if I reload, and edit a container, we can see the container type option is gone, and so all these containers are now using Flex. So then you would just open your pages one at a time, and save and refresh them, checking that the layout remains as it was. Depending on the options you have chosen, you might need to quickly make a few changes to the container settings. Just go through all the pages on your site and confirm it's all displaying correctly. Flexbox allows for so many different layout options than the older format, so do yourself a favour and convert today. See the Flexbox for containers and columns documentation link below for a full rundown on the various ways you can align content using Flexbox. Ok, that's it for this video. If you have any questions or need assistance, please create a support ticket and our team will gladly assist you. As always, we want to thank you for choosing Avada.